With a quick look at peace and love on planet earth uh, we have the kipu on fret 5 the song is actually played on the ukulele but just to get that kind of uh, a vibe to it i'll be keeping up to fret 5 on the song and i'm in the strand tuning but without the kipu you can actually play the chords and they will be pretty much easy it really sounds nothing like the song so i just want to bring that actual song vibe on the guitar with the kipu on fret 5 I'll show you guys the picking stuff which is done in the song, including uh, the chord shapes, which is D. I'm sorry, uh, A minor seven, mute open, second open, first open. Now for the A minor seven chord, I like to have third fret on the high E string with that A minor seven chord out there. So it's also A minor seven. And this is a G note, and this is a G note. So we get the minor seven, flat seven. And then we have just a minute. Uh, G major 7, I play 3 on E, E string we did, open D, open G, 3rd fret on B, 2nd fret on high E. Then I play E minor chord, open 2nd, 2nd, open, open, open. And then I play a D7, which is mute, mute, open 2nd, 1st, 2nd. Above the right hand, I use my thumb to pluck the top 3 strings, which includes E, A, D. Index to pluck the G string, middle finger to pluck the B string, and ring finger to pluck the high E string. So. Uh, the chord progression throughout the whole song is likely A minor 7 to a D7 to a G7 major 7 to a E minor. We got. Now, coming to that picking stop which we have, what I do is I pluck the bass note and the high E string at the beginning, and then I repeat the same thing again, followed by playing the B string. And a G string. So we got. For the D7 chord, you can simply strum the chord or pluck the D, G, B, E string. For the G major 7 chord, again, do the pattern. So you pluck the stamp E and B string. So E and B, E and E string, not A and B. E and E string. Then again, E and E string. B, G. Then strum E minor, or you can pluck E, G, B, E as shown in the tab. So we got. Now later on in the song, what happens is we just play the pattern for every chord shape. So we'll play A minor seven. Now we'll go to D seven. I'll do the same pattern. This time plucking the D string and the high E string. Again D and E, B G, then G major seven will be normal. And for E minor, it will be same as G major seven chord. Pluck the top E and the bottom E. Again B G. So we got. That's it and uh, later on uh, the song is like done there's like a specific part I think something like this we have that line uh, where we have this B7 chord coming in uh, in place of the G major 7 if I'm not wrong so you can play the B7 chord with a, just to bring a bit of, bit, a bit of tension it's 2nd fret on A 1 on D 2nd fret on G open B 2nd fret on high E so we got over here I'm plucking A and the high E string A and high E string B G so we got And that's basically the whole song you're ready to just jam along i hope the video helps you out for more accurate and easy lessons like this be sure to subscribe and drop me one of these bye